Hi, it's Hank here. Uh, I'm excited. I just received a big box from Doman in Germany, uh, of whom I order almost all my music gear, sound gear. And uh, I'm going to show you the unboxing of what I have ordered. Here goes. It's a big box. There should be some small things in it, but it's still a big box. We must take care at some to send everything as safely as possible, as you can tell. Lots of plastic wrapping. First, very important for me, patch cables. And there's a phone ringing in the background, which I'll ignore, ignore for the moment. So that's patch cables. And these I'm also very happy with pieces of foam. However, they are cut in such a way that you can put your loudspeakers on them. Sure, if you can tell, they're angled. Let's get rid of the big box because the pièce de la résistance is this pre-sonus pre firebox, a fire wire um, interface. Which also includes Cubase, Light, Reason Adapted 4, Sony Acid Express, IQ, Easy Drummer Light. Well, I've got the full version of Easy Drummer, so that's not much use to me. Ampeg SVX Uno, Virtual Bass Guitar Amplifier. But well, I'm used to those extras being in there. They're not always as much use as you might think, but in the end <laughs> it's the gear that counts. Oh they even included a fire wire cable which is great. I think I have some lying around but it's always handy to have one extra. Let's put that aside. Well a bunch of software Little feet, not the band, but uh, stick on feet for the presonus. This is the MIDI cable, which I probably won't use, but you never know. And an extra audio out, I guess. Manual would come in handy. I'm guessing this is the 220 adapter. Yep, that's the power wall ward. And I just have one more spot free in my power block. <laughs> so it's going to be very tight. Toit! As Austin Powers likes to say. Well done. And this then is the actual device. Ooh, that's nice. Firm knobs. No pun intended. Main level instruments. Combi inputs, so you can either input XLR or jack. I do have a mixer and a preamp, so I don't think... Well, you never know. Let's see what sounds best. This is where the MIDI cable goes like so it feels nice and sturdy it's all metal feels very pro and here are all the inputs line in the main out and outputs I said here are all the inputs but it's mostly outputs <laughs> oh well who's counting and two firewire ports 
so you can daisy chain another one into it and the 48 volts for the phantom power for uh, microphones or DI boxes that need a uh, 48 volts that stick on the feet I don't want to scratch any of the devices where it's going. Oh, there's a screw in there. There's a screw loose here. I think I'll be busy and in install that for a few moments. Just sticking the feet. Put the glue in nicely. It's not going to be rack mounted in my little studio. There's no need for that. This will work just fine. And this I always like. I'm sorry if you're a Windows lover, turn away now. This is the installation guide for Windows. And this is the installation guide for, Microsoft, uh, for Macintosh OS X. And the only thing it says with Macintosh OS X, the audio drivers for the Firebox are included in the core audio of Macintosh OS X, 10, 3, 7 and later. So all you have to do is connect the Firebox through Firewire to your computer and that's all. Sorry for the jibe at Windows, but it's one of the reasons I do use OS X. There you have it, the PreSonus Firebox. And here you can see the diminutive little box installed in my little studio stack. The mixer has become rather less useful. <laughs> and let's have a look if it all works. This is logic. I'm working on a little track. It's nothing much yet, but... I think we can conclude that it works. Speakers on their foam. And this was my old audio interface. Not a bad interface, not a bad interface at all. But this one is so much more convenient. Just plug in a guitar, as you see there's a guitar plugged in. Well, there's a plug in there. I can tell you it's a guitar plug-in. Plugged in. It's so much more convenient. Just plug in the guitar and away you go. No more routing through the desk. It's a lot easier. So there you have it. The unboxing and the demo of the PreSonus Firebox. I think it's a success. Now let's put out some tunes. <laughs>